This is the most frustrated I've been in a long time. I made a video a while back fixing the United States, and when I made the new map, I added a few colors because I didn't want a color to touch another of the same color. For example, resulting in the green goblin zone. But apparently there's a rule that you always have to follow. You're limited to four colors, no matter what. This guideline bothered me so much that I made it my mission to create a map that needs to have five colors minimum for the colors to not touch another of the same color. Have you heard of geocentric, uh, the geocentric model? This is the idea that the sun and the moon are revolving around the earth. This was the belief of how the, how the solar system worked for like super long. It goes back to ancient Greece. Look at that. Everyone thought they were so right about this. This dude, Philolaus, said, oh, actually, the earth is revolving around the sun. He was probably like super critiqued for his opinion, honestly. I would like to propose that I, along with the help of you, can be the next, um, what was his name again? We can be the next Philolaus because it has to be five colors, surely. Using Adobe Photoshop, I'm gonna draw out a map that needs to have five colors. Five make more sense. That's what I'm saying. I think we start with like a square. Let's make a weird looking shape here. I don't even have any thought process behind this right now. So if we fill this in, this has to be different because it's touching. So we'll make it yellow. This also has to be different because it's touching. We'll make that green. <laughs> Abstract art, yeah. Oh, here's what we do, here's what we do. Listen, listen. We come up with the five color theorem, right? It has to be five colors. That map that we come up with, that's going to be the new Picasso, bro. That's going to be like one of the greatest works of abstract art. Can you imagine? We're getting this in the Louvre. The Louvre. How do you say it? The, the, the fancy museum. <laughs> None of these three can be green due to green touching. So let's start with something like that, right? But this one can't be either yellow nor purple. So it has to be green. So we'll do, do that instead because it can't be touching that one. This one can be green because it's right there, right? And none of the other ones can be green we're only using three colors so far Let, let's go to purple right can't be purple can't be purple can't be purple these three can this can't be green or yellow so we're gonna make it purple move on to yellow this is touching both we're gonna go for that one now we have to figure out the loose ends and if we can't then i'm right <laughs> we still get a bonus color of red i gotta figure this out this one can be red this one can be red this one has to be different no, this is red, this is yellow, this is yellow. Four colors, we made that map work. So, what do we do here? Anyone have any suggestions to make this five colors? Hey, Penguin Man, I've had it. I've had it. You're just not believing, all right? Split background and color it. Obviously, this one can't be green. Four squares connected with a circle in the middle. That doesn't work either, because then the corner... I'll, I'll do that one really quick. This this is probably the most basic form of trying to disprove it. And then you're like, oh, what's in the middle has to be some new color because that's going to touch one of them. Then you realize it doesn't have to be that way. Look, that purple isn't touching that green. It can be a purple. What, what if both of these were part of the same map, right? Let's just make it green like we were doing before. This is the same map, okay? These are two small clumps of countries within a large country. We're going to make this red. This one can be green. Freak, man. That's already fine. Oh, what about something like this, huh? Tell me if I'm doing something wrong here. This seems too easy. Boom, pop, pow. Four quadrants, four quadrants. Windows logo. Now what's this color, huh? Prove me wrong. Oppo You're right. Opposite corners can be the same. <laughs> We're gonna make a new little circle, right? That's just red. Oh, it's so annoying. Surely there's a way. Help me. <laughs> I'm not defeated, just Jace won. I'm not giving up. We're asking chat GPT, all right? To disprove a mathematical theorem like the four color math theorem, you would need to find a counterexample that violates the theorem's statement. I know that. That's what I'm trying to do, chat. Why are you telling me to give up? You think I'm a quitter? I'm gonna make this my life mission, okay? I'm not saying it's my main goal in life. I'm saying that I'm gonna make it happen someday. Someday. Never give up. Hexagons. Think like a bee. How's that gonna help? You want me to draw a hexagon so bad? Look at this. Boom. Bop, 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 bop. Ow. People can't prove that it's right. The only way to prove that it's right is to make every single conceivable map ever. You can't do that. Nobody can do that. Goodness. Dang it. Genius 3. There's no proof. Look. Proof. You think I'm gonna read that? An elegant proof? See, there's question marks. They're not sure about it. They think they know. Look for disproof. Is there a whole subreddit? This is not super well drawn. Let's redraw this. This is a weird shape. That's not even a difficult one, huh? Let me visualize that for you. 
I want there to be a way. <laughs> I'm not giving up hope. I will never give up hope. I'm just saying this is so sad for me. I just want to be right. I want you to know I'm right. The greens are touching. Where? There's no two greens touching. What about the green in the small? Oh, you're so right. It can just be red, huh? There you go. Can you send it on Discord? You know, go for it. If any of you are also believers in this contradictory theorem, whatever, I want you to hit me up on Discord. Can the white be another color? Boom. See, it's 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 already disproven. I'm on your side and I disproved it. I like I'm I'm sorry. It's just how it is. Oh, there's there's more. This one's not too bad, I don't think. Mainly this one can be red. White can be the fourth color. This is like the exact same thing. <laughs> At least we're thinking alike. We're on the same wavelength, but that is the exact same thing. I, I, there's gotta be a way. The geocentric model, I'm telling you. Make it 3D. Okay, let's make it 3D. Do you guys know a good 3D program that's not too difficult? Minecraft! Let's boot up Minecraft, all right? We're gonna disprove this theorem real quick. And this is a great time for me to show off my new Minecraft skin that I made, all right? Look at this skin, guys. I'm so happy with it. It's me. <laughs> what about this block, huh? Let's make this out of glass, actually. How about this color? Is there something that explicitly says it has to be 2D? See, they only are giving 2D examples, but they've never said that specifically. Maps are not 3D. Look at this, 3D map. Earth layers. Look at this, this is a 3D map. Let's remake this, huh? That has to be a new color. Tell me what I can do to make that fit with the four color map theorem, huh? It has to be on a plane. What do we do now? What do we do now? What do we do? Someday we'll get it. Not today. That's okay. It's all about appreciation, uh, <laughs> appreciating what you got. And we got each other. We're gonna do it. I want you guys over the next years I don't care how long it takes. If you ever have a solution, make sure you think it through. Really try to disprove it. But if you can't disprove it, send it over. I want the I want to prove this wrong so badly. I'm not accepting defeat, Richard. We're just gonna do it. It can take so long. It could take days. It could take weeks. It could take our whole lives. Maybe we won't even in our lives, right? But someday someone's gotta do it. It's gotta happen. <laughs> It's gotta happen. I guess that's it. Subscribe.